Hawaii Overnight Adventures, it's not just a summer camp, it's an adventure, one that you too soon will be taking a major part in. Hi, I'm B-Dog and once again I'd like to invite you to our new and improved staff training video. Uh, you've all seen last year's staff training video, obviously a complete act of madness on the part of our uh, filmmakers. As camp director, I'd like to apologize for the completely inappropriate nature of that particular training video. Pally Overnight Adventures is all about clean, innocent, and wholesome fun. What happened last year was that our videographer at the time ran out of I was against hiring the son of But when I found out that he was doing it, and, and our other staff members were involved, they said I was full of So I said, to that. And they said, to me. And pretty soon, it was chaos, earthquakes, and everybody was full of But hey, that was the past. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, what you're about to watch is the complete Pally Overnight Adventures story. Here's the story of a boy named Cracker who was thrown out of every country he was found in, packed his things, came to America, up to Pally Mountain. And here's the story of a girl named Flame. Only 21 years old and counting When one day she left the land down under That's the day she came up to Pally Mountain Till the one day when that flame met that cracker And she giggled so much when he pinched her That they knew they must somehow form a family And run Pally overnight adventures Here's the story of a bunch of people most of them were out of towners. They left their day jobs, maybe their sanity, heesh, and became counselors at Pally Mountain. So now we must watch the rest of this video. You won't believe your eyes, there ain't no doubting. And we'll start things with this next segment. Now it's time to meet the staff of Pally Mountain, the Pally Bunch. The Pally Bunch. Now it's time, time to meet the Pally Bunch. It's 106 days till September. We have a full camp of kids, half a camp of counselors. It's dark, and we're wearing sunglasses. Hit it. It's astounding. Time is fleeting. Madness takes its toll. But listen closely. Not for very much longer. I've got to keep control. Seven days a week. Frosty, Horse Academy. Sunny, Horse Academy. Shocho, Horse Academy. Hi, I'm Droid. I'm doing Battle Box.
Jackal. Yuka. Hunter. And we are the, the unit leaders. leaders. <laughs> Disco. Rocket. Skateboarding. Skateboarding. Dirt, secret <laughs> agent kill. Let's start from the beginning. The history of Pally Overnight Adventures. Today, Pally offers 11 spectacular specialties, 75 afternoon activities, and one of the best facilities on the West Coast any camp you could find. Uh, initially, though, Pally wasn't quite the camp it is today. To illustrate, take a look at the following promotional video that we dug up in the archives of the first year of Pally. Pally Overnight Adventures, when things weren't quite as spectacular as they are today. For an unforgettable summer camp experience, come check out Pally Overnight Adventures. Included in your one-time summer camp package are all these explosive activities. You can sleep. Snow. Yawn. Stretch. Roll over. Breathe. Wink. Stare. Nod. Look up. Look down. Yes, even look sideways at no additional cost. Pally Overnight Adventures 7 Day 7 Night Summer Camp Package has started only $600. At $400 extra dollars if you would like the 14 days to be in the same week. The only thing not included in your one-time summer camp package is transportation. Food and a place to stay. Pally Overnight Adventures. If you want to become a part of Pally Overnight Adventures, call us at 1-888-6-SUMMER, talk to one of our operators and say, can you please tell me where to go? Counselor training is crucial to your growth here at Pally and affecting the lives of the young campers here at Pally. So during your week of training here at Pally Overnight Adventures, we'll train you on how to approach every possible situation that you might find here at camp. Back on the chain gang. Circumstance beyond our control. for creating a more beautiful and more vibrant pally. <laughs> Rule number one, the grass goes up. Rule number two, don't step on the grass. <laughs> Rule number three, if one single solitary camper even thinks about stepping on this grass, this is who they have to deal with. <laughs> Yet? No, it's working perfectly. Just keep snapping pictures, but you need to pick up something every now and then, okay? okay? Run over there and grab something. Look, act right. like you're working. Alright, okay. Are they watching? Yeah. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Make sure you walk past Michelle. I will. Give me a job, Mike. You better do the same thing. You need to have proof that you've been working too. You're right. Okay, here, videotape yes, okay. me really quickly, okay? Alright. You really want to try to get out of work? I've already done it once, and it's it's really warm. Um, so you just kind of walk over here slowly and take off you know, your hat, your extra shirt, and uh, you can if you wear enough layers, you can do that. You can do that all day. That can take up at least four hours. Uh, so you can put them back on when no one's looking, and then you'll you can go on all day. Take your time. 
it, you know? Yes. Yeah. And the other advantage is people see you taking off uh, articles of clothing, they think you're sweating, you're hot. Yeah, if you're, if you're, I mean, actually another good thing is, is wearing lots of layers. So, so when the sun starts shining, you actually just start sweating even if you're not doing anything. All right, so we got As a staff member, it's important for you to understand and acknowledge the necessity of rules here at camp. One of our rules is no sexual relations between staff members. Rule number two is no sexual relations with inflatable objects. Rule number three, no sexual relations with sod. A no-no is discussing your personal sex life with campers, like this counselor. This area is very, very hot, very, very hot, very, very hot, very, very hot. Of course we maintain a drug-free environment because after all, crack is a killer. <laughs> Let's talk about some of the things that you can expect to learn during your training session here at Pali. Um, Cracker and Flame, our two head counselors, will train you in a variety of topics such as proper table manners. Oh, oh. I'm both the Cracker. <laughs> How to cover up when someone accidentally sees you naked. <laughs> Anger management. This. Uh. Personal hygiene. I see you can pee the most today, okay? <laughs> we'll have a competition, you can pee the most. Come on, get an empty bottle. One of the new things we have this year at Pali is junior counselors. Junior counselors are actually former campers who were specially chosen to become junior counselors because of their diligence as campers and their strict obedience in following all of the rules here at Pali Overnight Adventures. We'll just give a general thing. Okay. Cabin 13. Our Cabin, really bad kissers. <laughs> yeah, really, really bad. Cabin 13 are bad kissers? Yeah. Really? Must are out here listening to everything we're saying. Oh, wait, 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 wait. wait. All right, now what makes them bad kissers? They don't know how to kiss. Some yeah. drool. They drool? Some are really sloppy. Sloppy how? Okay, you know. Our biggest attraction here at Pali is our five-star gourmet cooking with exquisite cuisine shipped in from all over the world. The entire planet, in fact. Hey, look! Here's a delivery coming in right now. Our staff is a very tight-knit group. You'll get to know each other extremely well. Yeah, now. This is Nicole. <laughs> in fact, our staff is much more than a tight-knit group. We're practically a family. A family that really knows each other well. Which brings us to this. If you change your mind, take a chance on the first day in life. I would definitely have to say, Vossa. There's got to be dirt, he's up there. And Voss, absolutely. And then, you've definitely got to have Rowdy and Tui. They're my top four. Dirt, um, Vossa, um, What's um what's John John Boy's name? What's his camp name? Rowdy, Rowdy and Rowdy. Tui. I'm gonna agree. I have to go with Rowdy of Dirt. I'm gonna put a vote in for Crunch because a guy can land his butt that many times. It's got to be Man of Steel. Speed Dog's got a nice ass too. I'm gonna say Gaucho and Dirt. Um, it's actually not a counselor. It's that horse over there. So <laughs> The, the brown one. Yeah, um, X Files, it's got a really cute ass. Dirt. Best male butt has got to be dirt. Nice one. Best butt on camp, I'd have to say B Dog, but we do all want to fuck NATO. <laughs> Actually, I've changed my mind. NATO. Actually, you know, what was I thinking? It's definitely got to be NATO. Well, definitely NATO. Definitely NATO. NATO, of course. Definitely got to be NATO. We, <laughs> we had a threesome with NATO. If you've ever been to camp before, you know that every camp has their own traditions. Pally Overnight Adventures is no different. We take pride in our very, very special traditions here at Pally. Vikingdin! We also have the traditional camp musical. Our camp musical this summer is Nutcracker. Yeah! 
One of our oldest traditions here at Pally is that we find two gorgeous women to make out with each other on camera for absolutely no reason whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, the key to a great summer here at Pally is solving problems lickety split. <laughs> so that about wraps it up for the 2004 staff video. We'll see you all next year. I'm getting too old for NATO's videos. Tell you when